Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we're gonna get into some thermostat issues. So I just put a video out about a month ago. I replaced the thermostat, the housing. I also replaced the water pump on the 03 Ram 1500 with that 5.7 liter Hemi. So the thermostat started acting up. I'm gonna walk over to the truck, hop in, so I can show you what I'm talking about on the gauge. And we're gonna get into it. All right, now we're in the truck. So, like I stated in the other video, the initial run of the engine, once you replace the thermostat, the thermostat would go all the way up. I need something with more of a point. To like here. And then it would open and it would run. So normal running temperature for this truck is from pretty much here to here. It hardly ever sees halfway, even with a 203 degree Fahrenheit thermostat in it, which I think is good for the Texas heat that we live in. I mean, that's dead summer it runs right there. So once I did my, my replacement, I noticed that every morning going to work, it would get all the way up to here, and then it would come back, right? Once it would open, it would run normal, except for normal was a little high because it would run about right here, right before that middle line right there. So that's not normal for these trucks, these 03 Rams with the 5.7 Hemi. It normally runs from right here to about right there. It's normal running temperature for these trucks, and that's dead summer. Um, so I noticed every morning that I had to go through the same process of, well, it almost overheats, and then it opens up, and then it runs kind of normal. So I started thinking to myself, what could be going on? My first initial thought was, because the overflow bottle was gushing water out, was that, okay, my overflow bottle is leaking out enough pressure that it's not maintaining what it needs to open and close that thermostat like it was supposed to. I put more thought into it. I kept driving the truck every morning. It was doing the same thing. And it, I was like, you know, you can buy defective parts brand new, and it does seem like the thermostat was sticking. So I pulled it out, and I put the old one. I kept the old one whenever I did the water pump replacement and the thermostat and thermostat housing replacement. Well, I kept the old thermostat because it wasn't bad. So I ripped the new one out, put the old one back in, problem solved. So what the point of this video is, if your car's running like that and you're noticing it, check your thermostat it's probably your thermostat either hanging up or your temperature sensor in there is starting to wear out it's old and two if you buy a brand new part and your issue and your issue doesn't go away it could possibly be the new part is defective so i just kind of wanted to put that out there because i just got done going through it on this truck a month ago like i stated I put the video out on replacing the thermostat and the housing, and the issue persisted. So with all that, this is Auto Guy DIY. Keep living the dream, doing your thing, like and subscribe, get at me with your comment, and I'm out. Ah!